Hello everyone, my name is Python and welcome back to the 24th episode of my Terraria Ranger playthrough in expert mode. Now guys, we're starting off with this guy because we need to buy this bad boy here, the illegal gun parts. Now as you can see, we have the mini shark, we've got the illegal gun parts, we also need the souls of might. And do we have any... I don't think we have any shark fins at all, do we? No, we don't, because we haven't even found any ocean biomes yet. Uh, huh. okay. Right, so, our first goal for today's episode is to go ahead and get the Mega Shark. We are going to be making the Mega Shark. It is going to be awesome, and it's probably going to be the weapon that takes us through the majority of early hard mode. Now, in the last episode, we did many awesome things. And, well, we did that one thing that actually allows us to... Get the Souls of Might, you know, taking down the Destroyer, which I completely was not expecting to do, by the way. I really was not expecting to take him down with only Cobalt Armor and just a Daedalus Storm Bay, you know. I was completely intending on using the Star Cannon and uh, doing it that way. And, uh, looks like Luke is throwing a party. Hey, man, where's my invite, you dang screw? Why you don't give me an invite? That's just rude, bro. Why would you do that? You're in my world, you're supposed to give me invites to parties. I mean, I I built you the dang places. This is rude beyond rudeness, man. I tell you something. But anyways, guys, we're going to move on. We're going to go past the dungeon, and we're going to see what the right-hand side ocean is looking like. Hopefully, it hasn't been crimsonified. Is a dungeon slash skeleton arena. There we go, go past that. And yeah, as you can see, we are now in unexplored territory, which is quite funny considering we're now in... Well, we're now in hard mode. It's kind of funny if you consider it all. But uh, yeah, anyways, uh, let's go ahead and get all this out. And uh, one of the things you guys were saying is, why do I still have the Hive Pack on me? Uh, I could have the Shield of Cthulhu one instead, so I have the dashing ability. That's a pretty good point, to be fair. So that is why I've gone ahead and uh, done exactly that. I've taken it off, and we've gone for the Shield of Cthulhu instead. So that's totally fine, folks. That is totally fine. All right. Give me that. Thank you. Onyx Blaster. So awesome. Hey, a chest. Hey, buddy. What you got for me? A spear. Brilliant. Always wanted a spear. Always wanted a spear there, buddy. All right, let's let's uh, let's do that real quick. Well, the good news is we've got ourselves another chest. Awesome. All storage is good storage. Buddy, get destroyed. <laughs> oh, you've got, you've got nothing on me, bro. Boom. Sleeping angler. We don't even... Oh, yeah, we don't even have the angler because we haven't even... Yeah, that's right. Hey, buddy. Oh, you popped out some confetti as soon as that happened. <laughs> What's this? Dynamite fish. Caught on the surface. Really? I don't have any bait, which is kind of sucky. So we won't be doing that. But uh, what we will be doing instead is uh, taking down some shark butt. So there we go, my friends. Oh, that's right. We've got all these to take out of the game as well. Or take in the game. Or whatever. Right, here we go, folks. We've got ourselves another chest over here. I'm going to go get this stuff. Thank you very much. And I think there's just one more. Yep, just here. Oh, man. There we go. Oh, God. we got to get out of here before our freaking air runs out. Oh, yeah, just about. Oh, yeah. You're not killing me today, Mr. Ocean. Not doing it. Not doing it today, folks. Not doing it today. And talking of the ocean, guys, spoiler alert, you may want to tune into this channel again later. If you're watching this video on the day of its release, I highly advise that you go ahead and check out this channel again later because I have got a new series starting. It's not a Terraria one, but it's still something that I know a lot of you guys have been requesting when I first made a video on it. So, you know, just a, just a little thing, just a little plug for other things. But anyways, guys, we need to go ahead and farm out these guys. But as you can clearly see, there's freaking no one here, which kind of sucks. So, you know, if some sharks could spawn in, then I can get their freaking fins. That'd be awesome. Uh, huh. Don't even have the ability to make kind uh, make any battle potions either, which kind of sucks. Uh, although I don't know, how far is the crimson? It's over there. If we get ourselves, do you know what? I think I could actually. If I go ahead and grab some vertebrae from the crimson biome, and also if there's any deathweed on the floor in the crimson biome, that'd be really really awesome. And then if I just grab myself some sand, I can make myself a little mini station, little mini alchemy station, and then I should be able to make a battle potion, and that might help us on our farming journeys, right? So, 
yeah, that's kind of a good idea. We're going to make ourselves a mini station in the ocean biome, and it is going to be awesome. So, let's go ahead and see if we can't find ourselves some deathweed on the ground here, folks. Aha! There's a bit of deathweed. Fantastic. Right, now what we need to do is we need to farm out some dudes. We need some vertebrae, folks. All the vertebrae. Hey, folks, how y'all doing? Kaboom! Get wrecked. Oh my god. This weapon is ridiculous. Hey, the dried's are out. Oh, that's right. Everybody died in the last episode, so that means, yeah, everybody's going to be spawning in again. Fantastic. Ha! Get wrecked. There we go. Right, now then. I do want to go ahead and try and make myself the hallowed ranged armor when I have the ability to, because I think that'd be a very, very good idea, especially in terms of increasing our defense. Currently, it's sitting at, what, 28? Wow, we took down the destroyer with 28 defense? That's crazy. Oh, but no, hang on a minute. Thinking about it, we had ourselves uh, an iron skin potion, so we would have had 36, right? So, yeah. <laughs> Makes sense. All right, guys. Let's uh, make our way back to the ocean, and uh, yeah, let's get this mini station set up, get ourselves a battle potion, and then we can farm out these dang fins. Here we go, folks. Just in the process of setting up the mini station, and then we should be just about good to go. We need a water bottle real quick. Uh, yep, there we go. You can go in there. And now we should be able to make ourselves one battle potion. Aha! Fantastic. Brilliant. What else have we got? Vial powder. Banishes the hallow. Banishes the hallow but puts crimson in its place? Is that what it does? I have no idea. Hmm. Huh. I don't really make vicious powder that often, to be fair, so... Might be interested to see what's going down there. But anyways, guys, let's go ahead and uh, whip this bad boy on. We have a battle potion, and that should mean that we should be able to get ourselves some sharkies. But I'm going to get rid of the mini-map real quick, just so we can actually see what's going down. So, let's go ahead and farm out some sharks, huh? Make it, make it rain. Make it, make it, make it rain. Yeah, I'm making it rain all the arrows. <laughs> oh, I love the Daedalus Storm, though. Such an amazing weapon. <laughs> Uh, Alright, how are we looking so far? We have ourselves uh, two out of five shark fins. Alright, man. Well, slowly but surely getting there. So let's keep ourselves going, folks. And I think the next cut I'll make is where we get back to base and we can actually make ourselves the mega shark. That was good. That was good. Mechanical eye? Hey, I only just noticed that. <laughs> we don't even need to go ahead and uh, get one now. We could summon in the twins if we really wanted to. Talking of the twins, you guys were saying... That what we should try and do is get some crystal bullets and combine them with our onyx blaster, and we can give that a go against the twins. Eh, I've never actually tried it before. I've always I've always opted for the mega shark, but it eh, could be interesting to try something else to see how it goes. All right, you can get wrecked. Oh, hello. Hi. Hey there, buddy. How you doing, brother? All right, no shark fin. That's three. Get in there slowly but surely. Oh, here we go. Here we go. These two guys are both going to give me them. There we go. There's one. And there's two. Hey, and now we can get the heck out of here. So, ladies and gentlemen, the time has come. Our first goal for this episode is about to be achieved. The Mega Shark. Boom! There it is. The Mega Shark in all its glory. Ginger the Mechanic has arrived to celebrate the fact that I got myself a Mega Shark, boys. That is awesome. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. What's your name this time? Arbac. Hey, Arbac. You're gonna give me, uh, you're gonna give me a good reforge first time, yeah? Boom. Nope. How about now? How about now? Yeah. Look at that. That's more like it. 34 range damage. Awesome. That is freaking sweet, actually. <laughs> all the damage, my friends. All the damage. Right. Now then. This can be sold. This can be sold. This can be sold. Uh, Souls of Mike can go in here. Mechanical Eye can also go in here. Archery potion can go in here. This can be sold. This can also be sold. Vicious powder. Uh, is it like a generic chest? Yes, there is. Okay, and then this can also go in here. And then everything else can be sold and stuff, I guess. Give me some give me some money. There we go. 75 silver. Thank you, buddy. I appreciate it. Right, what have we got? Pretty much nothing. <laughs> Alright, cool. Alright, so yeah, my friends, we're looking good so far. We could put I don't know. Do you guys think we could actually take down the twins with 28 defense on our hands? Do you genuinely think we could do this? If you guys think I could do this, then you got to drop a like button, okay? No, I'm kidding. You don't have to do that. <laughs> oh, this is going to be interesting. So, we've got Daybloom. We've got the, we've got these things. So, what we need for the Iron Skin Potion is the Iron Ore, right? So, let's just go and grab some out. Uh, yep, there it is. And some Lead Ore as well. Why not? Uh, glow Sticks. I eh, don't really need them. I could stay away. 
Right, and now we can make ourselves iron skin potions in the plenty. Here we go, look at that. Loads. Alright, so what else have we got? Archery, eh, might as well. Uh, should we just go for two of each? So, here we go. Let's get ourselves another... Oh, we don't have another Swiftest potion, apparently. Giant potion, and... Yeah, that'll pretty much do, right? I mean, we've got some more battle potions we can make. Right, so, let's head down here. Quick stack. So, we have regen, iron skin, battle potions can go over. We've got shine potions. Swiftness is going to be useful. Archery is definitely going to be useful. Calming? Don't think that's going to be useful. But that's just like a preliminary... I don't know. Don't think it is. Hey, the steampunk is here. Awesome. <laughs> All right, cool. Right, I'm going to get this out. And what we need to do, ladies and gentlemen, is we need to head down to the Hallow. I don't know, man. This could uh, this could prove to be a dip, bit difficult. I don't know. What do you guys think? Could we actually do this? Do you know what? I'm going completely the wrong way, aren't I? Right, we're, gonna, we're just going to go on the surface. Here we go. And we've got to try and run. Run, 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 run. Run, Python, run. Get those crystal shards, boy. Come on, man. Could we do it tonight? Could we do it tonight? That is the question. I believe I might be able to, but you never know, huh? You never know. Alrighty guys, just got myself 10 crystal shards. All I've got to do now is buy some bullets. I do believe you get 70 per time, so we can have a grand total of 600, not 600, 700 of these bad boy bullets. So here we go. Let's just head down here. Can we do this? Oh, it's 100 per time. Wow, I can have a full stack then. That's crazy. Okay, cool. Hey buddy. Right, we are just about approaching that time, folks. Alright, 300 more bullets. There we go. There's quite a lot there, actually. <laughs> all right, let's go ahead and uh, get all these things going. There we go. Right, I'm going to put them in there. We've got the one bullet there. We've got that going on there. And party time's over. Quite correct. Uh, we need to heal. Do we have a nurse? Hey, nursey. Hey, buddy. All right, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm actually going to relocate the nurse real quick. I'm going to relocate her to, like, here, just so she can, like, easily... Well, so I can easily heal if I need to. So, ladies and gentlemen, we are attempting the twins. This is my first attempt at the twins. Are we going to do it first time? Buff up. Have some of this. And here we go. I have no idea how this is going to go on, honestly. Right, the good news is we have the ability to dash. We are already using a health potion, though, unfortunately. This could get pretty rough. Hello. Whoa. All about trying to avoid his dash. There we go. Avoid his dash. It, uh, it's the green eye. We always need to prioritize the green eye because otherwise he's just going to kick our ass. All right. And he's back to shooting. Fair enough. Let's try and avoid his attacks at all costs. There we go. Not doing bad. Not doing bad. All right. And there we go. He's dashing. 22,000 health, I think I saw. Not doing bad. It would be cool if we could uh, heal up real quick. Okay. Let me heal up. Come on. What the hell? <laughs> I'm sorry for those of you guys who think that I'm cheesing fights, but I just wanna, I just wanna do this thing, man. It's not cheesing. It's called utilizing your resources. Okay, so you know that and stuff. Ah! I would have really liked it if he was on the other side of me. Actually, then I could actually. Oh god. My heal. My uh. Alright, now I just need to get the heck out of here. Come on, boys. What do you think? Can we do this? There we go. And back to that. Do you know what? I've got a good feeling about this. I won't, I won't get ahead of myself, obviously, but... There we go. Ooh. Ooh, there we go. Come on, boys. I think we can have this. I think we can have this. Oh, here we go. As soon as we get rid of that green eye, as soon as we dispatch of that green eye, I think we can have this. No, don't. There we go. Red eye left. All we got to do is survive against them for a little bit. Five, four... Three, two, one, and health. There we go. Right, I may use the nurse as well real quick, actually. And there we go. Okay, sweet. Just so I can have a little bit more health, huh? All right, cool. Now, I do apologize, by the way, if I've been, like, really quiet throughout this fight. I'm, like, genuinely trying to concentrate. But one thing I will say is, for those of you guys who were suggesting the Onyx Blaster 
plus the crystal bullets. Well done. Well done. I honestly wasn't expecting this to be as good as it clearly is being. I mean, as you can see, we're a head ton of damage, which is awesome. Uh-oh. Not looking good. Not looking good. Oh, that was close. That was really close, actually. Holy crap. All right. Here we go. Oh, man. Dude, the Shield of Cthulhu, even in hard mode, amazing. I love the fact that I can just, like, dash him. Dash avoid. All that kind of stuff. Amazing stuff. All right. This guy's almost done now. And... Done. Yeah, boys. He just got wrecked in the butt. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All right, ladies and gentlemen. There we have it. The twins have just been taken out the game. Right now, then, did the did the green eye drop a trophy by any chance? Uh, I don't think he did. Nah, I don't think I got further than the meteorite in the in terms of the fight. So yeah. Alrighty, cool. Hey, man. That's pretty darn cool. We took down the twins first time. Yes, we utilized the nurse, but I don't care. If you guys are the kind of people who are like, oh, you shouldn't use nurses in your freaking fights, just get out of this channel. Seriously, go away. I don't want your kind of sass, all right? So, yeah, I'm feeling pretty good about that. <laughs> all right, let's go ahead and open this up. 27 gold. Ooh, killing them. That's a nice amount, isn't it? All right, here we go. Let's go ahead and get up here. Let me just uh, quick stack a bunch of stuff. Uh, let's stack you up. There we go, 777 of them. Let's get these back in our uh, ammo slots. There we go. Souls of Sight can go over here. Mate, we are looking so good. <laughs> oh, we've got the mechanical wagon piece as well here. Obviously, we just need the Skeletron Prime one, and then we're good. Right, so let's go ahead and uh, put the buff potions away. Let's put away the money as well. There we go, looking good. Right, now then, are there any ranged weapons I can make with the Souls of Sight? I have a feeling there can be. Or is that Souls of Fight? I think it's the Flamethrower with the Souls of Fight, right? <laughs> fight, right? <laughs> oh, I make myself laugh. It's stupid. Anyways, uh, let's just head in here real quick. Are there ranged weapons? Yes or no? Pickaxe axe, obviously quite useful. Uh, but no. Logic sensor? Really? Activates whenever players are over it. Deactivates otherwise. I don't get it. So what's the difference between that and just a, like a pressure plate? All right, whatever. Anyways, uh, yeah, no no sign of any ranged weapons with that, unfortunately. But ladies and gentlemen, I am pretty convinced that I have enough hallowed bars to make myself the hallowed ranged armor. Let's go ahead and see. It is 12 plus 24, which is 36 plus 18, which I do believe is 54. Ooh, killing them. All right, so 15% increased range damage. And 9 defense on that. Okay. Hallowed plate mail. 24 is required. 15 defense. 7% increased crit chance. Uh, oh, there's 8% increased crit chance on there as well. So 15% so far. And then this has got 7% increased general damage. And then increased movement speed too. So we are going from 38 defense to 54. Wow. 54 defense. What the heck? Yeah. 54 defense. Wow. That is a hell of a defense increase. 30 defense. Going up to 50. Dude, that is just the most wackiest thing ever. <laughs> wow. I'm actually really happy about that, dude. That is insane. All right, where's my armor chest? There you go. With all of my other armor sets I've had, Crimson, Molten, uh, that little weirdo set that I had at one point with the gi and the viking helmet. The necro set, very good of course. And then you got this stuff here. Nice. Mate, we are, we're doing really well on the series, like for real. We are really doing well. I did not expect to take down the twins first time. We got very close to dying multiple points in that fight. But at the end of the day, we still did it. We really did. We still did it. And I'm very, very happy about it. So... The last person to take down, of course, would be Skeletron Prime. But I don't think I'm going to be able to take him down for a little bit. Unless I use the Daedalus Stormbow again. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. But that is going to be our next step of progression, I guess. Taking down Skeletron Prime. Dudes, we have breezed through hard mode so far. I am actually astounded at how speedy we are going through this expert mode, hard mode section of this Let's Play. For real, dudes. <laughs> Oh, man. Took down the Detroit first time without even trying. Took down the twin second time. I did have to try a little bit there with the whole avoiding thing. But uh, the Shield of Cthulhu was very much 
you know, a worthy thing to have on me. So, again, for those of you guys suggested to put that on instead of the high pack, much appreciated. For those of you guys who suggested to use the Onyx Blaster with the Crystal Bullets, very much appreciated. That is why you guys are awesome. You always leave excellent suggestions and all that kind of stuff in the comments area. I always read comments, so don't worry your faces. But anyways, guys, I think on that note, it is going to be time to end this particular episode. If it has been a shorter one, I do apologize, but I've just been, like, farming random stuffs here and there. But if you did enjoy this episode, be sure to drop a like rating, hit that subscribe button as well if you don't want to miss out on future content. And like I said before, tune in again later on today, my friends, for a brand new series on a new game. But thanks for watching, folks. I appreciate your continued support, and I'll see you guys later.